Well, as we broke the record yesterday with a high of 99 degrees, today we tied the record. Our high reached 95 degrees, and that record was set back in 1956. Now, if you're loving the heat, we have one more day in store for you. As of for today, a lot of us were in the 90s across the area, 93 over in Sterling, a little cooler over in Galena with a high of 96, and we did tie that record here in Rockford with a high of 95 degrees. For tonight, temperatures will cool into the lower 60s mostly clear it will be a very calm night and those dew points will start to fall as we will have a much less humid day for tomorrow dew points have been in the upper 60s for a lot of this week and we'll see them drop into the overnight hours as we do have a couple very comfortable days in store for us that will be much less muggier. As for tomorrow, those temperatures back in the lower 90s, 91 degrees for your high, mostly sunny conditions with that low humidity, of course. And if you are heading out with your pup early in the morning to walk your furry friends, that forecast is going to be perfect for you. Plenty of sunshine. Always check the pavement and avoid, avoid long exposure for our furry friends and even for yourself if you have plans for tomorrow that UV index is going to be on the higher end and those allergies will also be on the medium high levels so plenty of water to keep you hydrated and some sunblock will also keep you handy for tomorrow. Now if you've been looking for some relief from the heat we'll see that later this week as we'll drop into the lower 80s and even upper 80s by the time we get to Monday and you're probably noticing all that sunshine and very dry conditions as our next chance for rain isn't until Friday. And, and that's going to be thanks to this high pressure system that has been sitting over the area for the last couple of days. Already seeing plenty of dry conditions out west. As this high pressure system moves to our area, it's going to push out any of the rain chances that already passed us later in the day. Some of those storms were severe warned. We have stayed dried and we will continue to see this trend as we move forward. This high pressure system is going to bring us lots of sunshine and drier conditions. Speaking Speaking of that sunshine, we'll see it for the next couple of days with nearly no chances for rain this week. Those temperatures will cool as we get into the work week. 87 for Monday, dropping a little bit into the lower 80s there for you. Another hot day on Thursday, seeing that chance of rain by the end of the week as we do cool into the weekend. And for your most ten accurate 10 day forecast, we're seeing some chances of rain into that extended forecast, Sam, and very comfortable temperatures as well. Love to see that.